Hey guys, what's up? My name is Brett Newton. I'm the writer, creator, and the director of The Slammer. Thanks for stopping by and watching it. Um, this was a project that came about because resources were available. Uh, our, our, our co uh, my co-producer, Les Frank, um, provided the jail cell location, and I knew I wanted to shoot there. Uh, and I knew I wanted to tell a story with Atlanta actors and Atlanta uh, in an Atlanta area. Just moving here uh, last year, um, I wanted to kind of make a mark. Um, and I wrote specifically for specific actors. I knew I wanted to work with Shy Day, who is our female lead, and just such a strong, strong woman actress and just incredible. Um, this girl brings a lot to the table. Uh, Desi Banks, uh, he's a local comedian here. Uh, in Atlanta and just what a funny guy, uh, great improv and then just great comedic instincts. Um, I knew I wanted to work with him since I saw him a couple years ago uh, do some comedy videos um, and I knew he would be a fun guy to work with and he brought a lot to the script. He also improv in parts and just, I mean, really dove down into his character just settling and brought him really to the role. Uh, Charles, Charles Green who plays uh, the drunk um, I knew I wanted to put him in a project since the moment I met him and just the raw grittiness and what he can do. Uh, I knew he would bring a character to the role and he did not disappoint me. He totally just brought something incredible. Uh, and then there's Kelly Lockman who I, I've actually been in acting class with and, uh, and, and I knew I wanted to work with Kelly. He brings, you know, he has a look and a feel and an essence to him that just is perfect for the bloody man character. Um, Blake Bodden, uh, of course, you know, he's a good friend of mine and we've been working together now for over a year. Um, but, you know, I've seen him act and I've actually, I had him in another project uh, and I knew I wanted to bring Blake in uh, as the preppy kid. And, and, you know, of course, myself as the smart ass, just because that's kind of what I am. And, and, but, you know, first and foremost, I was always an actor and became a filmmaker kind of by trade. Uh, and then JL Pettigrew, um, he's the only one I didn't specifically write for. Uh, he was, in fact, a day of fill-in uh, for an actor who didn't show up, uh, who played the, he played the male officer. And, I mean, what a guy. He just got to set, and he picked up on everything, and he jumped right into it. A great attitude, great actor, and just a lot of fun to work with. And I, I look forward to working with all of these actors again. Um, we, had a, we had a great time. We had a lot of fun. Uh, the Slammer was just, it was kind of a passion project put together. Uh, I had the resource of the jail cell and I had the connection to all these actors either by knowing them or, or through a secondary friend or person. Um, and I talked with everybody and when I knew that they were on board I started writing. And actually uh, I wrote with them in mind even before I knew some of them were on board. Um, but uh, but and then you know the day happened. It was a it was a ten hour shoot day uh, for all the principal photography, which is everything you see in the jail cell. And then I went off on my own and did the B roll. Um, you know the 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 snapshots before the scene starts, or there's uh, at the end of it. There's one at the end of of the last episode. Um, and then and then really the whole the whole um, the original idea for the series was formatted as an Instagram series as a micro series I like to say um, is one minute episodes so that's why there's an arc every one minute is because every episode was a one minute arc that um, in the end and the way that you're gonna view it on YouTube. Um, or as a whole. So as a whole, it's nine one minute episodes put together uh, into a nine minute movie with credits, of course, so it's about 10 minutes. Um, but every episode just, every, every, every minute just kinda flows and flows and flows and it gets you sucked in and, and it keeps you wanting more. Well, hopefully, right, that's the goal. So check it out, leave some comments, uh, click subscribe. I'm gonna keep doing this, I'm making content, I've been making content for seven years. Um, and I've been acting for even more. Uh, so check it out. Uh, let me know what you want to see uh, because I'm always producing stuff and I'd love to see what you guys are interested in. Interested in. Uh, thanks for stopping by and I look forward to seeing you again. See ya.